uh, here we are now in June and as you can see Chinese knotweed wow it dominates I mean this is a beast I'm looking up and this is clearly over 10 maybe 11 foot tall and the sun is out it's a gorgeous summer day uh, we've had a couple of weeks of rain and you can see it's flourished really strong vibrant color of green on all these leaves all these leaves are beautifully matured you can see the zigzag pattern on the stems each of those heart shaped uh, leaves look at them they're in best health going the vein on the back so that's really healthy that is basically drinking in the light and the moisture as you can see if I step back you can take in you can absolutely see this dominates see the shading underneath and how dark it is under there there is nothing else that's going to grow here it's purely going to be dominated by this weed and nothing else uh, it's totally consumed from the neighbor's side and to the point that it's been so strong building up on the edge it's actually forced the fencing down so yeah we're gonna we'll do some cutting here get a treatment plan in place so the neighbor can obviously put a nice strong fence back there and claim back their garden but you can see this is literally consuming and I'm right underneath it I mean I'm just shy of six foot and you can see I am being uh, overlooked by these uh, this plant I mean you can still see even there we still have lots more growth to go it knows how to uh, maintain itself and survive you know you can see it in here is there are we've even got a bit of bindweed in there tying itself around uh, using it in order to uh, climb up and uh, get a bit of sunlight so yep there's a fair bit of work to do here to clear this uh, so yeah, June as I said, so this gives you an idea what it is But we got it up until September before obviously it starts flowering and then all the seeds will uh, drop onto the ground as you can see It's already started consuming from last season the area Even though there is a membrane down here that the clients put down, but it's insufficient We've actually got to treat the problem. It won't go away otherwise